on any event that you should want to add anything more in a repository that you know of, it's very simple. We'll go to System. We'll go to Add-ons. And there's one of two ways we can do it. We can do Get Add-ons, which will bring you to the call Repositories. Once you enter a repository, it'll tell you what that repository has to offer. In this case, it's a scan and a program add-on. And then add on repository. Repositories are what hold all XBMC programs and apps. We add most of ours straight from the XBMC repositories because we know those are verified. But you can add any which one on you want and you can load from which one you want. For instance, going in here, I go to Lombata and video add-ons, hit add on again, and we can see that there's other programs that we could add. So we'll go ahead and add MBA on demand. We'll click on it and much like we do on the video add-on from the top menu, we'll just simply hit install. As we can see, it's downloading and we don't have to wait for it to download, it'll add on itself. So once it did, it enabled itself. Now if there's add-ons that you don't want enabled or taken off completely, simply go up to the top menu again and we go to system. Once we're in system, we go down to add-ons. Once we go into add-ons, we go to enabled add-ons. Now if it's a video add-on that you don't want, you find the tab video add-ons, click on it, and then just simply find the add-on that you no longer want there. And there's two ways that you can uh, get rid of it. One way being to disable that add-on. That'll disable it so it won't show up on the video add-ons. But if it's an add-on that you would like to remove completely, just simply click uninstall. Once you uninstall that add-on, it'll go back into its respective re perspective repository, and you can go back and refetch it if you ever feel like adding it again.